So when you think of cheerleading, most people do associate this sport with females. But that's not the case for one elite team in Raleigh. Jordan Kramer introduces us to the boys showing his skills on the mat. In co-ed cheerleading, your body dictates where you fall in the stunts. Typically, taller athletes work as back spots. Most males are the bases lifting the stunt. And the flyer, the person who goes up in the air, is your most petite athlete. At just over five feet, Ethan Caruso was the odd man out. I'm not going to hold somebody up. You know, I'm too short, I'm too small, and my arms and my legs. His build fits that of a flyer, so he figured, why not give it a go? It's a lot of splits, straddles, and a lot of technical stuff at the gym and training at practice and all that. Ethan was a natural. He started coming in and kind of setting for fun, and he caught the eye of basically everyone that goes here. It didn't take long for Kelly Helton, the owner of Cheer Extreme in Raleigh, to offer him a spot on one of the gym's elite teams. He just has what it takes. There's, there's not really words you can put behind the presence he has when he's in the air. It's just very obvious that he enjoys what he is doing. Ethan is the first male to fly in an elite stunt at Cheer Extreme. And his back spot, Kaishim Elliott, has seen firsthand how seriously he takes that honor. He's actually just really tight. Like I said, like he's really like coachable, very technical athlete. And whatever he brings on the table, he gives it his 100% every time, and it works. Their stunt flies point, which means they're expected to hit, be consistent, and set the standard for the rest of the team. Ethan delivers every single time. It feels like I'm on top of the world. It truly gives me an adrenaline rush like no other. I love the feeling of people watching me. And when the crowd roars even more because it's a boy, um, it just brings happiness to my face. Okay, so that's the gym that my daughter I mean, goes really to. Good. He's incredible. And I get to watch him yeah. out of the corner of my eye, and I'm just amazed at how talented he is. He really is. And Code Black is what they call a world's team. So it's, okay. you know, the best of the best. Yeah. And uh, so they're really fun to watch. It's pretty but, awesome stuff. Yeah. All right. So if you have not seen the uh, latest. Oh, wait. Oh, wait.